Well, good morning, everybody. I'm uh, driving to the office. It's been a it's been a while since we've taken this drive together, so I'm sorry for that. I think if you missed it, it's weird. My heart's really heavy, and I'm thinking a lot about um, kind of the families. Well, not kind of the the families in Newtown and Connecticut who, uh, man, they just it's, it's a new week, and this is their first. It's the beginning of their first full week without, potentially without their, their kids. Um, and I don't know if that school is open or not, but this is uh, the first time that they're potentially sending their kids back to school after, after their friends, you know, after this terrible, terrible massacre. I'm blown away. And it's kind of been my, my thought for the morning as I've been driving already is just like, I can't imagine being the father of one of those children and driving to work right now. Like, I, I mean, I have a hard enough time already being away from my brand new daughter, let alone knowing that I get to go home and see her. It's crazy. Anyway, I want to say good morning and uh, we're taking this drive and the person in front of me, I'm not going to show you them and I'm trying to not complain, but uh, I sometimes go through this residential area that's just stop signs just to you know get to work faster and avoid freeway crap and uh, the person that is in front of me is not only coming to a full and complete stop beyond the stop line at every stop sign um, but they'll they will also stare forward for a, a few minutes or like a few seconds and then they'll look around them and then slowly proceed kind of annoying <laughs> but in the light of everything that I just shared with you, I really don't feel like that's that big of a deal. So I'm gonna stop complaining about it, but uh, it's time to go to work. So obviously, no matter where you go right now, uh, because of the whole school shooting thing, uh, the flags are at half mass. But I noticed this, I was leaving the gas station, I went to go get some, some water and stuff, and I noticed this. Pretty sure that's not okay. <laughs> the American flag wrapped around a light pole. So with that wrapped around the flagpole, or I guess it's not around a flagpole, it's wrapped around the light pole. I feel like, I yeah, just drove by it. Uh, I feel like, it, aren't we supposed to destroy flags that touch anything other than the sky, right? They're not supposed to touch the ground or anything else. Is that right? And don't we burn them? Which is weird because then around the world, people burn our flag and we get angry. Hmm. I, maybe I'm wrong. I could easily be wrong. I don't pay attention to that stuff. But I thought it was very interesting uh, that there was a flag uh, wrapped around a light pole. Now it's time for everybody's favorite game, give away your money! That's pretty much what getting gas is like, right? It's just giving, giving away your money. God, I hate getting gas. I think the price of gas has come down not as much as I would like, but it has come down, which is a good thing. So, all right, let's see how much we end up spending. All right, I'm not gonna look, I'm not looking. We're gonna get to 42.25. Or 40, I went, I went way over. Okay, we'll go for 43. I went over. Damn it. Oh well. It's still better. We were paying two weeks ago. I think I paid like fifty-six dollars. So I'll take the forty-three. Two amazing people doing. Chilling. Chilling. Mm-hmm. Cuddling. Cuddling. Hey. Just like one of her favorite spots, and I like it. I know. It's so cute. Loves lying on Cameron's chest, like loves it. It's really, really sweet. Really sweet. Daddy's girl. Daddy's girl for sure. She better daddy's girl. She's sure. starting out already, so. Yeah, exactly. I like it. Yeah, we're starting her young. You guys haven't seen me all day long. Um, I left my camera at Jessica's house, and um, after I realized it, I was like, okay, I can record on my phone. But then I didn't, so, you know, what are you going to do? But
Cadence and I had a fun day today. We hung out at home and I got a lot of Cadence time and that makes me a happy, happy mom. Cameron went to work and I just, everyone, no one really was home today so I kind of had the house to myself for the majority of the day and she slept a lot. She let me sleep a lot um, and yeah, it was a good, it was a good day. It was exactly what I needed. I needed to catch up on sleep. We're going to be going to bed here pretty soon, which means another full night of sleep, which makes me a happy camper once again. So, um, so yeah, I don't know. We're watching the Grinch and we drank hot chocolate. We turned the fireplace on, but it doesn't look like it because it's off now. I just turned it off. Hey guys, the whole house has gone to bed except for me. So I am on my way. I need to just do a couple last minute things. I just put Cadence to bed and I am going to try and go to sleep. So thanks for hanging out. Sorry you guys didn't see me much. Cameron's going to go get my camera tomorrow. He's going to stop by Jessica's house sometime during his lunch break or something. Um, and get my camera. So I'll have my camera tomorrow. So I'll use my phone. Things that you space on when you're a new parent. It's like, wow, how did I forget that? I never forget that, you know. So anyways, it happens. And I'll work on it. I don't know. I'll get better. I love you guys. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. <laughs> Oh, oh, now it's not fun? Now it's not fun? No. Save him for the thing. He's got the thing in no. his hand. Please. <laughs>